Hey YouTube, this is Kid Meech. This is part two of the opening of a Superior and Embor um, tins from the Black and White Emerging Power. Emerging Powers. Um, again, if you haven't seen the other one, just click it and you'll go to part one. This is part two, and all of the these both both of these tins um, have been already opened. So we opened these on Christmas because we got them for Christmas and. So basically, I put the cards back into their packs, the correct, their correct packs, so there shouldn't be anything missing. First I'll show you the card and then the figurine it comes with. So here's the superior, the card is 130 HP, the, oops, the Embor, the Embor card is, um, 150 HP. I like the Embor artwork, but relatively they're pretty similar for the, um, Superior one, it's like these gusts, gusts of wind with the leaves um going around, and the Embor one is like the flame that comes out of his um that comes out is like circling him so or kind of like waving around so they're similar in that sense. If uh before I open this, I'll just say this was my tin. The Embor one was my brother's, and overall from the pulls, I. I I got one awesome pull from here and one holographic. He got two holographics, so it's near balance, but since the card I got was better than a holographic, um, I would say if you're going to choose one of these uh, Tims, then go for the Superior. I don't like Superior more, though. I actually prefer Fire types, so Embor would be my preferred uh, Pokemon. But yeah. And Samurott, we're going to open a Samurott tin probably within a month, and then we'll post a video. I've already posted the Embor video, so just click there to go to it. So we got one Call of Legends pack. Here, let me just sort of put this back on. One Call of Legends pack. One Heart Gold Soul Silver Unleashed. One Black and White, and two... Um, emerging powers. Each pack, I don't know the exact price for each pack, but they came in the tin for five packs. Um, the Both the emerging powers come with code cards and the tin comes with one code card, and I'll show you those in a second. Here's the superior little figurine, and here's just this little close-up of the Embor one. As a comparison, the Embor is a bit taller, not by much though. Okay, I'll put that to the side for now. And underneath this, I put the code cards, which I'm not going to show you, but here's the one that comes with the tin, so it has the little superior. And the other two that just come with the packs, inside packs, um, of the emerging powers are just normal red ones. So, yeah... Don't try to like pause the video and look for the code because if I accidentally flashed it, I've already used them in the online TCG. Let's get this all organized. Then we can start. Ah, oh my gosh. So I like these tins better because it comes with five rather than the normal um, four. So. That's my overall take on it. It's not much different than the old tins. So the re it, in the very back, it'll be number nine. The card number nine will be reverse, and the card number ten will be a holographic or a different rare card. Mareep, Relicanth, Snubble, Chikorita, Teddy Ursa, Riolu. Research Record Trainer, Dawn Fan, um, Research Record Trainer um, Reverse, and an Ampharos Rare. Just want to make sure I open these in the right order. Yeah, I started off with the Call of Legends, I believe. Hopefully this is Call of Legends. Next, the HS Unleashed. I opened on the bottom. Okay. 
Magmar, Weedle, Apom, Spiro, Beldum, Golbat, Cheerleaders Cheer Supporter, Pupitar, Weedle Reverse, and this was the awesome pull. It's the Suicune half of the Raikou Suicune Legend from um, Heart Gold Soul Silver Unleashed. So this was a really nice card to get. Really nice. Um, great artwork. Uh, very. It's not digital at all. The it looks like it has brush work on the actual Suicune, and it looks really nice. Um, let's see what number it is. It's 93 out of 95 on from HS Unleashed. So that was the awesome pull. Let me put that to the side. Next pack, black and white. Snivy, Water Energy, Timber, Scraggy, Oshawott, Simisage, Audino, Dewat, Al Alamamala uh, um, Reverse, and a Zebstrika Rare. I'll open this one next. It is the Black and White Emerging Powers. Okay, Pansier, Swaddle, Roggenrola, Gothita, Joltik, Zorua, Great Ball um, Trainer Item, uh, Crocorock, Molga Reverse, and a Beartic Holographic. Hollow. Um, I don't know what I think so far about the holographic cards with the lines instead of the all shiny, but I really do like the new reverses that have this little, uh, depending on their energy type, um, they have these little reversed um, shiny design on the bottom over the text and around the card but the little lines sort of bug me on the actual picture for the holographic because they're not that much and you can barely see them I wish they were a bit more um, shiny because they are the rare cards okay and the last pack Basculin, Wubat, um, Petalil, Sandile, Pido, a uh, trainer, what is that? Max Potion, Whimsicott, Sock, uh, a Ferroseed Reverse, and a Whimsicott Rare. So overall, great pulls for this tin. I would say five packs, one, I would say it's about a super rare. So one super rare and one normal rare holographic. Let me just make sure it's a rare. Yeah. So one rare holographic and one super rare. I would say it's pretty good pulls for a tin um, out of five packs. And also for the Embor, because it was for five packs, it's two holographics. I think that's also a pretty good ratio of um, chance you can get. So overall, definitely go out and get one of these tins. Um, maybe the Samurott tin if you like. But yeah, this was a lot of fun to open. And it was definitely awesome to get those pulls. Thanks for watching. This is Kid Meech signing off. Please comment, rate, and subscribe.